And good morning, I'm Sean Quayer, live in the KEZI 9 newsroom. We are following a developing story this morning, a bomb threat at Fern Ridge Middle School. All students evacuated this morning. We're told that the school has since been searched and police gave it the all clear. KEZI 9 News anchor Bob Schaefer has the latest on what prompted police to clear the campus. He's live right now in Elmira, Bob. Good morning, Sean. Yeah, I want to say first and foremost for anybody who just may be tuning in for the first time, the kids are all safe. All 321 kids here at Fern Ridge Middle School. There is no bomb. There was never a bomb. This started around 730 when staff arrived and they found graffiti uh, painted all over the north and west walls of the building. One piece of graffiti said, quote, we have old dynamite the school blows at 10 a.m. Obviously, this was very concerning to the staff. They immediately called the Lane County Sheriff's Office, which sent their five-man bomb squad here, along with a canine unit from Homeland Security. The building was checked perimeterally. It was checked on the inside, and the roof was checked. Meanwhile, the children, as they arrived, were sent to two nearby elementary schools, uh, Benita and Elmira, uh, which are very close by. Around 10:15, the building was cleared and it was determined that the children could come back. Now, I wanna uh, bring in Superintendent Dennis Fredericks from the uh, Fern Ridge School District. And Superintendent, uh, you've never seen anything like this before. Nope, I've been doing this a long time. This is the worst I've seen. Uh, the kids were never in any danger, is that correct? That's correct, but uh, we needed to get them out anyway to make sure that anytime there is even a false bomb, bomb threat, we take it seriously. And what sort of effect does this have on kids, do you think? You know, we always worry about, well, will this encourage other kids to do it? Uh, you know, and that really, I don't think that's, that's the case. This isn't a case of extreme, you know, uh, you know disrespect or, I, you know, I can't even describe, you know, why a person would do it. But it's pretty rare that a student does this kind of thing. And, of course, one of the priorities will be cleaning this graffiti off. Absolutely, as soon as possible. Okay, thank you, Superintendent. We appreciate your time. I know it's been a very long morning for you. And, Sean, of course, the investigation continues. I talked to uh, the sergeant from the Lane County Sheriff's Office, and as the superintendent pointed out earlier, uh, children are not very good at keeping secrets. So if this was a juvenile, there's a very good chance that uh, he or she or them uh, will be found uh, sooner rather than later. Live at Fern Ridge Middle School, Bob Shaper, KZI 9 News. Sean, back to you.